I'm just going to say one thing before we continue. I have taken a investment for my channel that will completely change my whole channel. Alright, last time I posed the question, do I take a small loan of a million dollars? Yes, the answer is yes, I just took a small loan of a million dollars because I think it's in everybody's best interest to end this series uh, because it will take at least another 10 parts before I can actually finish the series if I grind that shit. And uh, right now, it's not taking particularly long. It's really just saying give or take the same amount every uh, every other series takes, but yes, now let's go and look for cars because uh, I should do Should I even look for cars? We have enough money to just straight to buy a vehicle from here, and I'm not too sure which kind of car I want, but I am banging on an 840 Ci. That's a pretty cool car. Uh, maybe a 500 SEC is very cool. So it's a w This is the W140. No, this is this is the the, the coupe, the classin, the classin coupe. Why am I looking at big luxury ca cars? I don't know. Is that a Focus RS? Yeah, but like low key, a Focus RS might be good. These fenders look as about as real as my fucking future in, in life. That's not very real. <laughs> what, do you, what do you mean the stock has like fucking... Right. Right, cool. Cool, cool. Let's let's try... Let's buy an A40CI. And uh, see if I can modify this car. To go... For it to actually go fast. Because we don't want a slow going car. I'm just going to say one thing before we continue. I have taken... A investment for my channel that will completely change my whole channel. It will, it will change the channel. It will change how the channel is perceived and how the channel does. All right, I'm making it sound like it's a fucking some epic kind of thing, but I just spent some money to make everything better, uh, and I'm hope soon, hopefully soon, you guys will see that. I will make a video and all that stuff. I, I, I hope you guys. Well, appreciate what I've just done, and I, I, I think you definitely will, because right now I'm not. It appears that I'm not fucking about with my channel. It, it, I, I'm, I've, I've been going hard for a solid amount of time. I love making. I mean, I like making the game videos, but I fucking love making the IRL car videos, and we've got a bunch more planned. So you know, I'm taking. I'm taking the channel to the next step. I'm taking the channel to the next step, which is, is a step I should have taken like maybe three or years, three four years ago. But that's. Irrelevant. Yeah, let's see what kind of engine we got here. We got a BMW V8. That's so cool. And actually, we have the actual model for the car. Is this a devil's up? Yes, yeah, fucking devils, man. The fucking devil. And I bet this thing like won't even move. How much? Like these are like 300 horsepower stock. 353 horsepower. How the fuck do we make this car or this engine more powerful? Because this is still a test period. I'm not sure which engine I'm gonna go with. Which uh, fucking car I'm gonna go? Can I just throw a two? No, I can't throw a two JZ into this because we don't have a two JZ into this, in this game. Fuck! I should have installed a two JZ. The engine selection in this mod is about as deep as my um fucking uh, about as not a lot of mod, not a lot of cars, not a lot of engines. This is a BMW S65 engine, so this is the M3 E92 engine, which makes. 403 horsepower, so slightly better than before. Which not a lot still, considering my Audi makes like 500, 600, some fucking shit like that. Uh, we got an AMG 55 engine, which is a supercharged Mercedes Benz. So this is the E55 uh, S55 engine, which is a extremely good engine. 514 horsepower, yeah, that's how the curve looks from Mercedes Benz, I bet. I'm probably gonna go with this one because it's supercharged and we might be able to go faster. I cannot modify the supercharger. Perfect. Do we have fuel injection anywhere? Fuel injection anywhere, Borowski? I wanted to get it to fuel rail so I can make the car uh, faster by making a diesel or some shit. Because <laughs> that's how it works, but it did not work, alright? It did not work. What are these 16 inches? No fucking way, IRL. The goddamn 840Ci came out with 16 inch rims. I completely. No, no. I I'm not gonna judge suspension, just wheels. I mean, t more specifically for the tires, I'm doing this. Tires and engine, and just see how it does. Okay, we got some filthy. Ah, yeah, that's looks that looks much better now. They do kind of look small, but still. 
that I fit them on the front end is beautiful. Amazing. Let's go and test this car out on a night race so we can compare it to the Audi because that's our benchmark. It's sad because we don't really have many cars options, many many engine options. Oh, listen to that little blow off, dude. Not blow off to that little spoolie boy. Yeah. It seems like it's one of those engines that cannot put down the power. Like, it, it's, it's got big numbers, but it's not moving fast. Alright, I've been, you know, please stop. I've been moving the car around and, uh, you know, giving it gas around the corners and all that good stuff. It's, 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 it's not a very good handling car, first of all. That's, uh, I'm going to say that. It's a bit tail happy, but you'd expect that from 500 odd horsepower. Grand Coupe A. Um, but I don't think it's going to be a fast car. But I don't think we're going to find any fast car in this game. But, like, the fucking the BMW looks so cool, dude. The only thing that's left... Well, that's a good launch. Why is it shifting at 5,000 RPM when the red line is... Right, I'm gonna go on manual. I'm gonna go on manual. There's no fucking reason to... I mean, I guess the launch was not bad. The car was fast enough. Honestly, it's just very many limitations of the mod itself. 12.1. I mean, we are somewhat fast. Let's look back at what cars we've had up until now. We had the first car, which was the Volvo, uh, amazing wagon. The second car, the BMW, uh, fucking M3. Uh, the I forgot what it's called. <laughs> the fucking the M Coupe A. He has the M Coupe A, the BMW M Coupe A Z3, which also is kind of a wagon form. And now the RS2. Which is a wagon. I mean, this is a coupe hatch thing, but fucking close enough. Now, we, we've had a BMW, a Audi, and a Volvo. And I'm thinking about doing something else because, just for the simple fact, we don't need so many. Let's, let's have a different brand. So, because I don't trust such things as the Mercedes VA, because I just bought a, 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 a CL coupe A. I, I, I don't know, I quite like this, how it looks, and we, very ridiculous car to bring uh, to the race of champions. We've got a normal, normally hatch, an actually aspirate EV8 making 419 horsepower with a very bland uh, race uh, curve. And that's uh, fucking, uh, probably going to be slow. And we don't need slow, right? We don't need slow. So I'm going to do that, and I'm going to do one of these. <laughs> you might be like, Whoa. this is the Volvo 850 engine, which is a Fiat engine, but this is the same engine that carried us to the win time and time again because this engine is mega good by far the best engine we've uh, had up until now so diesel oil obviously the fastest uh, thing 826 horsepower bang bang shebang this is ridiculous i've just put a five cylinder engine Oop. <laughs> i mean it looks ridiculous it definitely looks ridiculous let me just get some tires I actually think these tires suit these rims suit the car extremely well, but I think it would be funnier if we had some aftermarket rims. Now I don't know how the car will look at the end because I'm gonna build it through uh, if we if I do use this car. So I want to put the 255s on the front and I'm gonna throw two 295s on the. <laughs> None of the, the rims like have. Sizes is only 19 inch. It says only 19 inch. So uh, I thought maybe they will work uh, unanimously, but they, they they didn't. Maybe we don't actually have any. So these look like a bigger rim uh, tire. So 295. Maybe we don't have wide enough tires and uh, wide enough rims in this game to. Well, that's a pretty wild wide tire, bro. If you ask me. Low key, I still prefer the stock wheels. No, that came on the car and did the goddamn T37s, bro. But fucking, that's irrelevant. Let's go and try this car out. All right, let's see first impressions of the W140. Um, what is this thing? What? What are you? Can I get the mini map, please? Thank you. Well, that's a, quite a different mini map than I expected. All right, all right, all right. Let's see. <laughs> I mean, oh shit, I mean the car is very, 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 very heavy, this is a C-Class Coupe after all, and Coupes are funnily enough one of the heavier T37 
types of uh, cars you can get. So I'm not too surprised that it's not as fast as the Volvo. But we'll see how it does. All right, all right, let's see. Oh, please stop. The car is not stopping at all. Again, Nathaniel Owens, bro. Well, let's see how you do. Let's see how you do. Uh, mostly, I want to see how my car does compared to the BMW and the Audi. Audi, I don't know how much it ran. My uh, 12, around the 12 second again, the BMW ran at 12.1. So let's see how this does with the most superior engine out of them all. The uh, Fiat 5 cylinder. It's got its own soft compound tires, so. Mm. It's not doing too well, is it? It's not doing too well at all. <laughs> I mean, it felt dead. It felt quite dead. Huh. It was not the uh, most exciting run. 12.3, so slower. There's no expected. Well, uh, that's that's our situation, guys. Do I do I use the B do I use the BMW? Do I use the uh, the Mercedes? Or do I build a different car that you guys would like to see from this mod pack, obviously, uh, that you guys would like to see? And uh, should I use a different? Yeah, fucking dude. It doesn't matter. Like uh, next episode, whatever you guys say. Uh, if you don't say anything, uh, I'm gonna continue this. I'm gonna finish this series within <laughs> within three, two, three episodes. No, yeah. So guys, thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next one.